Hello and welcome to my unboxing of the Evercade Versus. I've never seen or done an unboxing, so <laughs> let's see how this goes. I don't have a professional setup, so I apologise, but I have bought an arm to hold my phone so I get a better angle. So hopefully that's good. Bit of background history, I'm an AG. The very first game I ever completed was the Dragon Mountain for the Dragon 32. It didn't even have pictures, it was all words. And then my very first proper grown-up job was at a chocolate factory. It was horrific. It wasn't like Willy Wonka. It, re it really wasn't like Willy Wonka. And I saved and saved and saved. And I got myself a Master System and a Game Gear from Willy's when they were in the sale. When they finally went in the sale. So I'm super excited to be opening this up. So let's see. Okay. <laughs> I'm genuinely super excited. Ooh! Okay, I... I, it's bigger. It's bigger than I thought it would be, the box. God, it's really heavy. Okay, I'm just going to pause a sec while I hack the plastic off, all right? I'll be back. Okay, I changed my mind because I thought some people might like watching the plastic be cut off. So, you can watch. <laughs> oh, God. Ooh, it's a nice satiny box. Okay, oh, God. See, that's why I wanted to take the plastic off because I'm like... Super clumsy. Here we go. Hang on. Let me get that box out of the way. Ooh, oh, it's such a nice box. Oh, wow. It's so smooth and satiny. Evercade versus retro game console with 18 arcade games, including Double Dragon and Burger Time. And I remember both of those. And I have Burger Time. I'm sure that was on the Dragon 32. So those are the two cartridges it comes with. There's a little look at it. Is that, is that, can you see it like that? Which is better for you? Cartridge system, up to four players, so you can have four people on the go at once. Expandable library, which is due. Officially licensed games, which I really like because you're not scamming anybody. And over 260 more games available. Sorry, I just had to pause it because I nearly fell over it because at my age, kneeling on the floor isn't good. So it's got 1080p on the TV, which is great. Oh, there we go. Can you see that? Yeah. Obviously got a console, two controllers, USB cable for power. It's got the two cartridges on the front and a quick start guide. But we don't need no guides. We know what we're doing, don't we? Only fools read manuals. So the Evercade versus Retro Game Console Premium Pack. Complete your collection. So that's some of the other cartridges you can get. Had a little look on their website. At the moment, you can get 28 different cartridges with 26 working on the verses. The Namco ones are exclusive to like the little handheld one, which is adorable, but I'll come back to that too. So here we go. With hindsight, I really should have sat on a stool, but here we are. So there's probably gonna be a lot of pausing. <laughs> okay, so compatible with 25 plus cartridges. So I've already gone through that. Come on, fame. Play in HD on your TV. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, save states and retro filters. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? Okay, I didn't know about that. It's got built-in Wi-Fi, which I really, really like. And that's what put me off the handheld because I don't have a PC or anything or any way of upgrading. Why is this keep going blurry? I'm so sorry. Um, Up to four players, which I've discussed, dual cartridge. And compatible with many third-party controllers. Yeah, that's actually really cool. You can use loads and loads of different controllers with it. Okay, there's a little picture of the controller. And that's what you get on the back. And then this side is just like super cool. Okay. Seriously, thank God I discovered the pause button. So you don't have to see me rolling around. <laughs> so... It includes two collections of 18 games. Maybe it's better like that. Is that better like that? We'll have a close look at those when I actually look at the cartridges. And then just on this side, it's again got the image with the two controllers. Okay, let's slide this bad boy off and see what's going on. <gasps> Ooh, oh, listen to that. Oh, is that not really satisfying, right? <gasps> Ready to play together? Yes, definitely. <laughs> Me and my imaginary friends. Okay, <laughs> Evercade versus. Oh, I tell you, it's so shiny. The box is so shiny. Look at this. Oh, I love it. I love boxes like this. They're just oh, so satisfying, right? 
So the Evercade is an emulator which by a process of magic and a 1.5 gigahertz processor lets you play olden day games or retro as the kids call them. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, it's so cute! Oh look! Oh god, I don't want to... Ooh, ooh. Oh, okay, let's go. Oh my god, I can't get it out. Oh, oh, okay. Oh my god, don't break it. Can't... <laughs> I'm going to break it. Oh, I should have paused. No, it's really hard. Okay. Okay, there we go. Let's just ignore that I messed that up, shall we? Oh, look. It's sort of like a creamy, but not full on cream. It's like an off white. Oh, look at that. That's so nice. I don't know why. There we go. Ah, oh, dual cartridge system. So there are the four little slots for your controllers. Oh, wow. I'm so excited. So what's this? That's the USB. What's that one? I can't read that because I've got really bad. I've got really bad eyes. We'll come back to that one. <laughs> and there's the bottom and it's got little feet for it to sit on, which is perfect. So how do we open this? Oh, look. Oh, that's so cute. That's where the slots go for the cartridges. Guessing this is the power button. Look at that. <laughs> okay let's pop you over here little one let's see what's in the box so we've got the cartridges that's the first one the technos arcade one cartridge there you go and it's got eight different games on it and we'll go through those once i've turned it on and we've got the data east arcade one with 10 different games okay okay what's under here Ooh, the controllers. Okay, quick start guide. We don't need that. Ooh, oh wow, they're bigger than I thought, right? I mean, you don't know what I thought, but I I thought they were going to be smaller. I'm going to compare them to other controllers in a minute, so you get an idea. Okay, that's a good long cable as well. Do you remember the olden days of like sitting in front of the TV or at the end of the bed, like half an inch away because <laughs> the leads didn't reach, right? Okay, that's the power. Oh, mate. <laughs> and there's the other controller. And I swear they're so much bigger than I thought they would be. Okay, I'm just going to pause a sec again while I get the other controllers for comparison. Okay, good. So here we are. We've got the PS5 controller, we've got the Xbox controller, we've got the NES controller and the Super NES controller, and we've got the Mega Drive controller. So it's, the actual unit is just a bit bigger than the Mega Drive controller, right? And this actually isn't far off the Super NES. So, oh my God, I'm sorry, the door went. So I had to start a new recording. So I really hope I can get a free app to stitch this together. So this is a comparison of the Switch controllers for you, okay? So that's, I'm just excited. <laughs> I'm really excited, okay. So let's have a little look at the cartridges. I wonder how big they are. Actually, let me pull, actually no. And the thing is, I can't like go back and like rebox it where I've messed up. So you're just gonna have to roll with it with me, do you know what I mean? So there's one. Oh, wow, okay. Oh, they're cute. There you go. <laughs> and let's get the other one opened. Oh, man, shrink wrap, you know. You don't need it. Actually, you don't need to throw this in the bin. You can collect it and take it to a recycling centre. A lot of supermarkets have it. So don't throw this stuff away, okay? It can be recycled. And there's the other one. And I'll be back in a bit, hopefully, when I've set it all up. Okay, so I just watched the video back to see. And I don't know, I was just so excited. I kept calling this a USB. It's clearly not a USB. I can see it's not a USB. It's clearly an HDMI. So I apologise <laughs> for my brain. And it's also got dark inside, sadly. I wanted to finish it before it was. So the light makes it a bit difficult to see. But we're going to have a quick little flick through the booklet. Hopefully... Hopefully you can see Burger Time, which I loved. I remember being black and white. 
so I may have had a burger time ripoff or <laughs> just like my memories in black and white <laughs> bad dudes versus dragon ninja gate of doom dark seal wizard fire dark seal 2 break 3 <laughs> tumble pop darwin 4078 slice spy chain reaction and lock and chase and then there's here some other cartridges that are available and it's like the olden days booklets do you remember yeah and sometimes they used to have space at the back for a cheat code so this is the technos one arcade one a little bit about technos there double dragon 2 the revenge double dragon 3 the rosetta stone the combo tribes don't know how to say that I haven't heard of that mysterious stones block out yeah <laughs> mania challenge look at that uh-huh minky monkey battle lane volume five <laughs> and then some more info again i'm also super excited because dizzy was one of my all-time favorite games on the master system along with cosmic spacehead the cartridge got here haven't opened it so let's have a look oh look <laughs> i'm so excited cosmic spacehead is also on the way but it's taking ages to get here because it's coming from america oh look oh dizzy i love you so much dizzy so this has got <laughs> i'm so excited the fantastic adventures of dizzy which was my favorite i love that so much oh look i used to get so stressed on this like barrel section wonderland dizzy panic dizzy <laughs> oh i can't read that bmx simulator i can't read that because of my glasses what does that say Oh my god, if you can read that, well done. Something Hawk. Pogi, Dream World Pogi. Pogi, I love Pogi from the Dizzy games. Dizzy Adventurer. Mystery World Dizzy. And Treasure Island Dizzy. Ah, oh, that's so cute. Okay, this is great and like super exciting and it's made me really, really happy. The USB lead that you need for the Mega Drive Mini is the same as the one you need for the Evercade. So I don't have to climb around the back of the telly and neither do you if you've got one of these. So hopefully your hips will stay intact as will your back and your knees. Okay, so I'm gonna try and do this one handed. So, oh God, do you really need to see this? Uh, yes, look at that. Okay, come on. Oh, which way up? I haven't got my reading glasses on. Okay, oh god, is that in? Uh, yes! Oh, look at that! That's like some pro straps. <laughs> oh, there we go! Hello, little friend. Right, I'll be turning you on in a sec, all right? Okay, what do you feel, KK? You new friend? Yeah, cool? Okay, good. Again, doing this one-handed, I'm going to be connecting the controller, but I thought some of you might want to see how long the lead is. Really long! <laughs> <laughs> really long it was three meters right so yeah that's long but i don't really understand measurements so oh this is going to be rough one-handed oh my god come on you can do it woman oh my god usb yes here we go it's happening i did it look at that like why is it so difficult to get the usb the right way around first go because i'm not you kk you're right kk would have done it right away right he's the boss of everything okay Okay, so I'm going to try and put a cartridge in, one-handed as well, because that last one went really well and I'm really professional. So let's open her up. Oh, hello, are you hungry? Okay, can you see the cartridge? <gasps> it's like in the olden days, you can blow on it. You have to blow on it gently, and that wakes up the pixies and fairies in there that move the pixels around so you can play the game. Okay, well, how does this go in? Let's have a look. Okay, not like that. Like that. <gasps> yes. Maybe. Oh, is that in? I didn't hear a click. Did anybody hear a click? I think that's in. Yeah? Is that in? Are you in? Yes, it's in. Okay. 
I'll be back and we'll turn her on. But I'm going to remove the cartridge for the first boot up just in case that messes with it. But I just wanted to show you how I put it in, which wasn't great to be honest, but I've learned. <laughs> lights came on. <gasps> okay, it works. I'll show you the lights in a minute. Okay, cool. Oh my God, I'm really excited. I've got a stool now. You can't sit. Oh, that's not me. That's not my joints. <laughs> What's the stool? <laughs> Is that gonna... Is that okay? Okay, is that good? Yay, yeah, good. Okay, English sets. So I can't see anything now. Alexa, light on. <gasps> I don't need it. Okay. Oh, Alexa, light off. <laughs> Pro unboxing. Set up Wi Fi. I'm sure you can find a professional video with capture cards and stuff for gameplay. Okay, that's. Like, why is part of it missing off the edge? I guess we will see. Oh. The TV volume on. Let's whack that up a bit as well. Olden days checking system is just like 1987. Oh, here we go. Now what's happening? <laughs> oh my god, what do you think about the uh, Blaze reboot? Anyway, how are we feeling about that? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, are you falling over the phone? You better not be. I want you to calm yourself. Okay, I already published the video, but this whole bit was just so, so blurry. I'm trying to do it by hand and I hope it's better. So those are the various settings. Here's the aspect ratio and let's pray, okay? Okay, there we go. So there's the original ratio. There's pixel perfect. There's full screen. Yes. <laughs> Shaders and scan lines, none. Subtle scan lines, strong scan lines. Bezels off, Evercade neon, Evercade origin, wireframe, ratchet loft, Lego legends, box art, white arm. <laughs> scan lines off, scan lines on. Going over to theme. We've got, this is dark, Evercade Neon, light. In the sound settings, there are, ooh, <laughs> oh, you can't see, VGM volume and SFX volume. In network, you don't need accessibility. Can't read that there, but there's high contrast mode, which is great. Languages, these are all the languages available. I only know some of them, so I'm not going to embarrass myself. System, as what you would expect, to be fair. Legal and support, a lot of stuff I'm going to pretend I've read, thank you. Credits, the hardworking people that I will sit through, but not now. So thank you very much for sharing that. And secret, that I'm not entirely sure what that means, because it's a secret. Oh wow, okay, look, <laughs> this is a much better way. Are they all on there though? I can't tell. Are they all on there? Yeah, I think they are. Okay, good. BMX simulator, all in day's work, battle lane. This is so much better than my rubbishy video of the booklet. <laughs> Block out, Dizzy the Adventurer, Double Dragon 2, The Revenge, Double Dragon 3, The Rosetta Stone, Dream World Pony, which looks adorable. <laughs> Firehawk, go as you go, Mania Challenge, I'm so excited, Ricky Wanky, Mystery Stones, Mystery World Dizzy, Panic Dizzy, Super Robin Hood, um, the Con Comba Tribes, which it kind of reminds me of, oh, what was that Let's Get Down to It Boppers film, oh man, what was that film? Um, the Fantastic Adventures of Dizzy, Treasure Island Dizzy and Wonderland Dizzy. Well, we're going to have to start The Fantastic Adventures of Dizzy. Oh my God, I'm so excited. 1991, that was only 10 years ago, right? Yeah, yeah, that was only 10 years ago because if it was longer, I'd be really old. <laughs> the evil wizard Zax cast a spell on the yoke folk and kidnapped Dizzy's girlfriend Daisy. I remember, it's up to our rotund hero to undo Zax's wicked deeds and rescue Daisy from the castle in the clouds in Dizzy's biggest adventure yet. Play mini games, collect stars and make use of 
Um, where did I get to? <laughs> wide array of items to save the day. If you're hurt, find some food and chow down to keep Dizzy from getting scrambled. During elements from a variety of Dizzy's adventures over the years, The Fantastic Adventures of Dizzy is like a greatest hits album of excellent fun. <laughs> okay, so look, here are the controls. Well, let's have a quick look, yeah? And then I want to see if the Mega Drive controller works. I honestly don't know if it will. Okay, I feel it should, but we'll have it. Oh my God! <laughs> I really hope that's all in there because I can't see my phone screen so I had to like turn it around. <gasps> this music! Oh my God, the music! Oh my God! <laughs> this music! <gasps> I'm actually gonna cry. Oh my God! Oh my God, am I really crying? It's dizzy, I am. Okay, sort it out. Okay. Wait, have I got to select? Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! I can't believe it! I'm so happy! Oh wow! Oh my god! Daisy has been captured by the evil wizard Zax. Only Dizzy is brave and clever enough to rescue her from a terrible fate. Leaving the safety of the Yoke Folks G House Village, Dizzy sets out on his greatest adventure. My cheeks actually hurt. My cheeks hurt. Oh my god. Oh my god, there he is! I remember this, the key! Oh my god, I'm not gonna play a lot because it's about the console, but. Oh my god, how do I get up there? I don't remember. See, I need a block. Oh, jump. Oh my god, okay. I can do this. Yes! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so happy! Oh my god! I probably need the key to get out, right? Okay. Yes. 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 <laughs> Pro gaming. <laughs> Is that? A oh, I messed up. Okay, I didn't. No. Oh, I nearly over. I nearly over egged. Yes. How do I pick it up? No. A. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I'm so happy. Is A the door? Ah, oh, Dizzy. I love you so much. I love you so much. Oh, Dizzy, look, 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 I remember this. And you had to restart every time, right? Oh my God, I remember Cosmic Spacehead had codes, but I don't remember Dizzy having codes. The plank of wood, I need to cross something soon. <gasps> Dizzy, I am so happy. I am so happy, I can't cope. Oh, it's Pogo. <laughs> Come here, I need to cage to catch him. Oh, I am so happy, but I can't expect you to sit through me screaming for 20 minutes about this. So thank you. I'm going to pause and see if Mega Drive controller works, and then I will be back. Yes, it does. Yes. Yep. Just to confirm, the Mega Drive controller <laughs> does work with it. So yeah, the box didn't lie. I am super happy. Thank you so much for watching. If you got this far, you deserve like all the medals and all the good karma in the world. Thank you so much. I'm gonna go play Dizzy. Oh my God. <laughs> Thank you, bye bye. Okay, I actually lied about going. I wanted you to see the light, but it's not coming up as red as it should. It's like a really super good red, almost like the red on the actual console but I just didn't want you to miss out. So when you turn it on, that's actually similar to the white when it boots up, but it looks super red and no, it's not happening. And I don't know what, there, there you go. We had a fraction split second of it, right? Okay, I'm definitely going now, okay? Promise, okay, bye.